Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we are moving further with our cutscene animation, and uh, I have just created the cutscene animation here. And you can see that our characters. If we play the timeline, you can see that. Uh, sorry, this timeline. If we play this, you can see that these characters are just uh, getting inside the bus, and uh, then this character as well. So we have created animation for these uh, only these uh, characters. Uh, definitely, you can add more, more and more characters if you want to do so. Uh, but I will not do that. And uh, that's it. This is our animation. So now we will just set up our camera for this animation. Uh, definitely, we have one uh, default camera which is uh, RCC camera and which is for the bus itself and uh, we don't have any other camera and uh, we have to add a camera for this animation so we will just create a camera so we'll just uh, create another camera here and uh, we'll rename this camera as a cutscene camera or whatever you want cut scene camera and then a very important thing is that we have to add a component which will be animator controller to this camera uh, because we already know that if we don't have any animator controller to our uh, camera we can't add that uh, camera to our timeline okay so it is very important so now we'll select uh, the purple bus animation and uh, here we will just create another uh, another section so i will just make it minimize and then we will right click here and uh, we can add another uh, animation track and for this animation track we can add a cutscene camera okay and now for the cutscene camera we will just uh, uh, define the positions and uh, for uh, that we can just start the recording button here okay after recording we will just set up the camera so here you can see that uh, we have this camera but uh, we don't have positioned the camera so we will just select the camera and we will just uh, resize uh, just move this camera and uh, definitely we can just make it uh, bigger and uh, here in this uh, preview we can see this preview here so we can set up this camera to our desired position so maybe uh, maybe the first frame will be uh, here maybe okay that's good and let's add it a little bit like this yeah this is good and uh, now we'll just move further uh, with the camera and uh, we'll just add the another position so for this frame uh, we will just move the camera right away to this side a little bit more backward and uh, also we'll just move it like this and we can move it a little bit back like this okay and then we can just uh, uh, move to another position uh, maybe uh, here and then you can see that we can uh, just move it a little bit more here to this side and uh, a little bit back downside as well if we want to do so okay so we can just track the position of these characters and then uh, at this spot we can just move back again we can rotate it again like this and then uh, I think we can just uh, move it little bit like this and uh, again we can move it to this spot i will just move camera a little bit like this and uh, yeah that's good and then again we can move it here and we can just move 
back to the spot and a little rotation as well and then you can just finalize the camera sequence at this spot okay that's it uh, so now if we uh, move uh, if we play our animation in camera preview you can see that uh, our camera is also animating and uh, we can stay as see our characters uh, to move inside the bus like this and that's great that's what we want so that's great we have uh, successfully created a uh, fine animation and the uh, now the very important thing is that uh, how we will enable this animation on uh, reaching uh, this point and then after finishing this animation we can move further uh, so for that type of functionality we need definitely the scripts as well and uh, also we have to set up some uh, other things as well so initially we'll uh, just select this bus purple which is uh, which will be here actually this one okay and uh, we can just disable this bus as well uh, for, uh, for for the uh, initial point and uh, then uh, after that we will just um, enable this when we will reach at this spot okay so you can see that animations are fine and uh, uh, one more problem is that uh, whenever we will play the uh, play the game you will see that uh, uh, the animation will start playing uh, itself you can see this animation is playing although we can't see the animation because our camera the main camera is this one and uh, we can't see the another camera but uh, definitely it's moving uh, like this okay so let's see what we will do uh, next in the next video and uh, how we will finalize this cutscene animation.